Okay, that's enough of that. Sam, like I said, these shorts are not for everybody, okay? The bad B life ain't for everybody. But it, it's for me, okay? You can't choose it. It chooses you, and it chose me. This, I'm trying to hide my shorts marks because I'm super insecure about them. I am like, I have like a bralette on, but I feel like I just need to put a regular shirt on so that nobody gets the wrong idea or nothing, you know what I mean? What's up? My name is Naira. Welcome to my channel. Welcome back to my channel if you've been here before. What's up? Today, we're doing one of my favorite types of videos. I'm just going to be trying on some outfits, giving y'all some outfit inspo because I know a lot of you guys are like me. You turn to YouTube, Pinterest, the gram when you need like an outfit inspo. Like usually I can just like put everything together up here, but sometimes it's just too much. I'm an anxious being. I get overwhelmed. My creative juices aren't flowing and I need a cute look to inspire me to make my own cute look. So that's what we're doing today. We're just trying on um, some summer outfit. It's act up season. The hot girls are out. It's a city girl summer. We want to look cute this summer. It's that season. Let's just go ahead and get into trying on some outfits, okay? If you can't tell, I'm excited about it. Okay, I know the shorts are short. I know, I know. But I'm grown, so I wear what I want. I understand that not everybody will be comfortable in this. These are my Daisy Dukes. These I bring out when it's 130 degrees outside and wearing any other pair of bottoms is not an option. Okay, let's get that out the way. This is very like hot girl to me. It's like I'm chilling, but I still look cute. A little bit of mid drift out, cute little tank top. Like this is so me because like, let me let me show you what to set this off. You like, I look like I'm about to film a music video. You don't even want it with me right now. I love this. I understand, like I said, these shorts are not for everybody, okay? The bad B life ain't for everybody, but it, it's for me, okay? You can't choose it, it chooses you, and it chose me, and this is it right here for me because it's so simple. You don't, you're not showing a, you know, a super amount of skin, but you know, the booty cheeks a little bit out, and that's okay, it's hot outside. You know it's hot outside when you go outside, and it's hot outside, right? Okay, it's hot outside. I can wear a little bit of some, some. I can shake, I can shake some, you know what I mean? It's hot. This, that's what hot girl season is for. Outfit details, these bottoms. I actually got these at Marshalls a long time ago, but you can find small shorts anywhere, literally anywhere. Um, and this top is from Shein. It is. A, it wasn't my Shein haul that I just uploaded, so if you didn't see that, it was my second to last video. Go two videos back and you got yourself a Shein haul. Again. These outfits are not for the faint of heart or the easily offended. I feel like I need to remind y'all that. This outfit is very much like, I'm dressing down today, but please don't ever forget that I own a private jet to me. That's the vibes that this look gives me. I'm gonna stand on my little fuzzy stool so you guys can get a good look at the pants. Oh God, I've gotta find a better way to do this. These are the jeans. These, I understand, are not gonna be everybody's taste. Super dramatically ripped, like ripped, busting, busting through the seams kind of ripped. Um, but I really love this. I'm trying to hide my stretch marks because I'm super insecure about them. Like how different and how super ripped these jeans are, which you can do yourself. I ripped these jeans myself. I know it's a lot of rip. I like it that way. Um, if you don't wanna waste a good pair of jeans, or an expensive pair of jeans, go to the thrift store, find a pair of jeans that fit you that you wouldn't mind ripping and just rip them to your heart's desire. Um, these don't, these almost don't fit me anymore. One or two sizes up and these won't fit me. And I want a more comfortable fit, so I'll probably redo, like do another pair of ripped jeans like this. But anyways, it's not what we're talking about. So yeah, I know that this is not for everybody. I know that the rip having your whole thigh out is a lot for some people, but it's just enough for me. So yeah, I love that how different and super ripped the pants are, compliments the top. I'm here for it. I'm here for it. 
Oh, mm, okay, that's enough of that, ladies. That's enough. There we go. I pushed y'all back. We got a bit of a better view now, okay? Now y'all can really see how popping I am. This right here is my sweat. Uh, the girl. This right here might be my favorite outfit out of all the outfits we're gonna see today. Because look at me. This is just like with a, with a pair of sneakers with some like white Air Force Ones, bro. You straight up would not be able to tell me anything. The reason I love this outfit is the juxtaposition between how flattering and feminine and tight the top is with how flowy and loose and non-shapely the bottoms are. And then the the opposing the opposing styles and the opposing color difference. What? I just I am way too good at this. Do y'all even see my body in this though? Even though they're not super like like form fitting and like shapely, like I still look so good. This kind of gives me Tiana Taylor vibes because she's always kind of dressed like a little tomboyish. So let me explain. First of all, yes, the bodysuit is from Shein. It's fabulous. I know. Um, so the reason I'm doing another jean look is because I don't know about y'all. I live down south right now. This is my first time living in the south. It is 100 and plus 100 degrees and up every single day. But I'm from New York and then I moved to Maryland. Every summer day is not a jean summer day. Some days there's a breeze and your kneecap's gonna be a little cold if you're going on Daisy Dukes. But you, it's still warm enough for you to have your arms out. So that is why I'm giving y'all some versatile jean and pants looks. It's not everyday shorts, okay? We not wearing shorts every single day. Doesn't make sense for most, for most people that live in a normal rotating climate, climated area, chlamydia, okay. So this top, like I said, is from Shein. It is so, so, so cute and I'm obsessed. These jeans are from Charlotte Russe, RIP Charlotte Russe because they shut down. Um, as long as they don't shut down Shein because I would literally have a meltdown and never shop again. But yeah, this is super cute. Again, super versatile for anything chill. Um, but even still, this could be dressed up as well. If you put on like, uh, just like a pair of heels or something with this. Like I have these, my clear, like the Kim K clear heels. So cute. That would be so, like such an easy way to dress up this whole ensemble. So yeah, I'm actually living for this. And I love some side boob action because I don't have breasts. It's not a secret. You, you can look at... You can look at my upper body and tell I don't have breasts. So, I have the uh, the privilege. I have the privilege of wearing side boob. And it's the only privilege I have as a black woman. But we're not, that is for a whole nother video. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all. I ain't even gonna hold y'all right now. Getting all dressed up is cute, but this has been my go-to everyday outfit. Put on one of my favorite band tees, a pair of biker shorts, the black ones or the gray ones, and let's go. It's too hot outside. I, like I said, I live down south right now for the first time ever. Um, the biggest, the biggest culture shock is the weather. It is 100 degrees and up. 100 degrees is like the low where I live. So it's like, bro, can I please just throw on a baggy shirt that'll allow me to breathe, it'll allow my pits to breathe throughout the day while I'm sweating, cause you're gonna sweat. I'm not somebody that sweats a lot and I like come home sweating like I've been at the gym all day. You're gonna sweat here. And some biker shorts because they will make the outfit look like you're not just wearing a t-shirt. They make your booty look good. Um, they just add a little pizzazz to it. Boom, look, full outfit. Throw on some sneakers. I'm a sneaker girl. Like I love CMOs and I love to have my toes out but I also love sneakers. So I always fight back and forth when I'm getting dressed. I'm like, I'm like a pair of Jordans would really like make this fit go crazy, but I wanna have my toes out. <laughs> but yeah, this is my everyday fit. Like this is, this is real. This is me, 
I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. I'm gonna let the Um, but yeah, this is me on a daily basis wearing shorts. Usually, like I said, don't do denim shorts. I usually do the biker shorts like this, and we keep it pushing. Kim Kardashian helped put biker shorts on the map, so we riding out. We riding out for her because she helping get black people out of jail, okay? You see this? Oh, oh my God. I'm not just dramatic. Like, I've been feeling faint all day. I have hyperthyroidism and Hashi, well, I have Hashimoto's disease, which is why I have hyperthyroidism. It's a uh, hormonal thyroid autoimmune disease, whatever, Google it if you wanna know like more about it. Um, the only reason I say that is because whenever I like say like on camera, like, oh, I feel so tired or like I feel sick or like I feel like I'm about to pass out, please know guys, I'm not being dramatic. I have literal health problems. Like I'm always on the verge of, I'm always on the brink of death, okay? <laughs> The Grim Reaper is always right around the corner. This last outfit we're gonna call Girl Next Door. This is super simple, super basic, um, perfect for a date, a picnic, going to a museum, a walk in the park, going to get some ice cream with your boo. Like you can wear this literally anywhere. I'm just sorry, I had to move the camera down. But the shorts are not too short. I look like I got some scents. I look like my mama taught me better than to walk out the house with my booty cheeks out. Sorry, mom. Um, and the top is really simple, but still really cute and girly and flirty. Like literally every girl has something like this in her closet. A pair of jean shorts, jorts, if you will. I hate that word because it sounds so stupid. Um, when I hear the word jorts, I think of like suburban white mom Bermuda shorts. Ugh, hate it. Um, and just like a cute frilly little crop top. Maybe a little off the shoulder moment. I love this. I think it's so cute. I really love it. And it's not as out there as some of my other looks. Not everybody will wear, um, not everybody feels comfortable in like something as tight as a pair of like biker shorts. Not everybody feels comfortable in extremely ripped jeans. Not everybody feels comfortable in tiny little crop tops. But this is like modest. This is something that um, anyone that's fairly comfortable with their body will be able to wear. So it's important that I showed y'all an outfit like this because you don't have to be skimpy or like trendy and dress in like what you see on your feed to be cute. So yeah, I wore this shirt in the Dominican Republic and I literally haven't worn it since because I cannot find an occasion that I feel worthy enough for a shirt like this. I love it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I had so much fun filming this video. I knew I would. I always have fun filming videos where I'm putting on clothes and talking to you guys about outfits. I love these videos because it always leads to us connecting. It's always a conversation. It's like trying on clothes before you go out with your homegirls. That's what this video feels like to me. And your homeboys. And your homeboys. Thank you guys and gals for watching because if you weren't watching I would literally be a crazy person talking to my camera and trying on clothes I still am but you know what I mean like you give me purpose follow me on Instagram and please subscribe it will help your girl out I am growing so fast and I'm so grateful and I will see you in the next video bye boo yeah all you self-promoters are janky We established like the Yankees This whole fucking game thankless We moving militant but somehow you the one tanking No limit to where I could take it And you know me as a crisp bottle sender Check pick up or I thought we looked out for one another Saw us all as brothers in a struggle Too blessed to be humble I guess it's different in the city I come from